Thank you for tuning in and thank you for supporting our channel. But if you are new to this channel and you haven't subscribed yet, please encourage us by doing so and we shall continue to bring you the latest news as they come. And together we shall walk with our great leader, Mazin Namde Kano, IPOB and Eastern Security Network to make our Biafran dream a reality. He say, my brothers and my sisters, forget about the noise the Fulani Nigerian government and their terrorist minister of justice, Abubakar Malami, are making. Come Monday, July 26, 2021, if the Fulani Nigerian government continues with Mazin Namdekanu's court trial, there will be total war. And Two million freedom fighters, home and abroad, from Biafra land and from Odudua nation, and other freedom fighters, including some foreigners, they will storm Abuja to bring the zoo down completely. The zoo will come down completely. You know, Abubakar Malami said that IPOB members should not be seen with Biafra Estigna at the Federal High Court Abuja on July 26, 2021. That is a very big lie. That is a very big lie. If the terrorist Fulani Janjaweed can brandish AK-47 and walk about freely and no one is touching them, then Biafra Biafrans will come with their regalia. They will come with their regalia. They think it is all those peaceful protests that they will now come and send their terrorist military and police to start shooting. There will be total war in the zoo. The zoo will be set ablaze. It will be set ablaze. It is either we have Biafra or nothing. The Janjaweed Fulanese must understand this. They must understand it. You know, talk is cheap. Talk is very, very cheap. You can talk. Nobody will charge you for it. You don't pay to talk. Abubam Kamalyami talk is very cheap because that is the day Biafra will gain freedom and independence. The Fulani Janjaweed, they know that. They know that. That that is the day Biafra will get their freedom. Mazen Namdekano freedom will shock millions of his enemies and millions of Biafran enemies. It will shock them. And all the enemies of Biafra, all the Efulefus, all the saboteurs, they will run away from Biafra land because it will be too hot for them. Because Biafra shall be free. Malami and his gang of Fulani terrorists will be driven away and sent back to Futajalon. They will be sent back. They think that we are playing. They think Biafrans are playing. They think it's a joke. They think it's by acquiring a helicopter, gunfighter, or gunship, and all those things that will help them. They should go and ask what happened to the Fulanese in Central African Republic, where over 26% of the population are Fulanese. Talk less of Nigeria, where the Fulani population is less than 6%. The Fulanese have touched the tail of a lion and they will be consumed. They will be consumed. No amount of weapon will help them. No amount of terrorism will help them. It will not help them. Because the zoo must be brought down. 
and set ablaze. The zoom must be brought down. How can the Fulanese be dictating, you know, to other Nigerians and Biafrans? They can't. The problem we have is that our politicians are too afraid to call the Fulani to order. They should call them to order. But if our politicians have sold their soul to the Fulani Janjaweed, if our politicians are afraid to tell the Fulani the truth to their face, if our politicians are not ready to do the right thing, then Biafrans, then Oduduans must do the right thing. And the Fulani Janjaweed must be put to shame. They must be put to shame. They cannot continue to support terrorism against other tribes in that zoological republic called Nigeria. A fraudulent contraption. There will be a total war. The Fulanese, they know this. They are just using their media war to dampen the morals of Biafrans. They want to make people afraid because that is what they know how to do best. What they know how to do best is to put fear so that they can, you know, succeed. They only strive when there is fear. But when people come out, they will be put to shame. They will be put to shame. You know, the only language Buhari and his Fulani Nigerian government understand is when Biafrans and freedom fighters storm Abuja Federal High Court come July 26, 2021, as the terrorist Nigerian government begins their kangaroo trial of Mazen and the Kanu. But they know that once that happens, they are in trouble. That will bring an end to the terrorist regime of Buhari in Nigeria. It will bring an end to it. My brothers and my sisters, let us not be afraid. Come July 26, the Fulani Nigerian government must be brought down. They must be brought down. They cannot continue to terrorize Biafrans. They cannot continue to terrorize Yoruba nations. They cannot. They cannot continue to terrorize the Middle Belt. Everyone must rise up. Everyone must rise up. They think they have taken over the military. They think they have taken over the police. They think they have all the weapons. But they lie. They should go and see what happened during the Arab Spring. The people didn't have ammunition. The people didn't have fighter jets. The people did not have armor tank. They don't have all those things. But they brought down the government in the Arab nation. During the Arab Spring, they brought it down. And that is what is going to happen. The Fulani government of Buhari and all the Meyetiala terrorists and the Fulani terrorist bandit and killer headsmen, Boko Haram and Iceweb, must be brought down. Thank you, my brothers and my sisters, for watching this video, and bye-bye for now.